Hey guys, it's Jeremy, and today I'm just gonna do a quick review on all the headstrokes that I have. Um, you might think, Jared, how, how much headstrokes do you have? I have a lot more. It's been a while since I did headstroke reviews. So, and, there, and it's been like like a couple months, not even a year, for like the Hasbro's car review in Hes 2016. First, I'm gonna find like this stuff for the camera. I'm just gonna put it on my base. Okay. I usually make this base for fun. So we're gonna just start off with my newest one from 2018, which is the Hess RV. So right here, here's the Hess RV. He's pretty cool. I got him, I got um, Hess RV on my birthday, 2018. It, it, uh, my birthday's on December 9th. Maybe um, um this year on my birthday, I might do a an unboxing review for, for like lots of toys that I had got on my birthday or maybe on another time so I might not make the video but we'll see and um, I'm sorry if I, I from um, last year I said I was gonna do like a Christmas um vi live stream but it can because um, my mom like doesn't want me to it's because like it's like about private it's like about um, private stuff I was just thinking of doing it this year but I'm just gonna probably have to ask my mom again Okay, we're just going with the Hess review. So here's the Hess RV. He looks pretty cool. And um, the exclusive cars that it comes with are the Hess ETB and the Hess motorbike. So here's the Hess motorbike. Yep. Yep. Let's okay, so um, these two look small compared to the Hess RV. He's hit the Hess RV is pretty big. Oops, sorry. So I'm just gonna move the camera over to this desk. There. Let me get the Hess RV. Thank you. Well, I gotta say that um, Hess ATV. Well, Hess motorbike is a little bit smaller. And um, Hess ATV. And it's like the second tallest, and um, I think, and then his RV is the first tallest, like the tallest out of the whole thing. So that's this is his RV. And please leave a like in the video if you like Hess. Make sure you also leave a like on my Hess truck videos. Okay, let me just move this to the side. We're, we're gonna skip um, the test dump truck. I already did a review of um, Hess 2017. 2016 and 2009, which are the, which is the Hesby car, the stump truck, and the, another Hess truck. Okay, so now we're gonna take a look at this truck. He looks like a little different. This one is Hess, Hess 2010. If this, if, if you can't tell, it comes with a jet. I'll, I'll get the jet real quick. There it comes. Okay, so it comes with a Hess jet. Like, this is where the jet goes. I got this on Christmas Eve 2018. Like, um, I, every year, um, I usually go to, um, a party with my aunts and uncles and cousins. And then after that, I usually just, like, re read a story called Twas the Night Before Christmas. And before we did that, um, I, um, this was the gift from my one of my grandparents. I had like from my mom, mom, if you don't know her. But um, the sad, the sad news is, is that um, on Christmas Eve, like um, on Christmas Eve morning, sadly my puppy died. Sadly, it's a shame. I shouldn't even be bringing bringing that up again because my if my mom watches this and she figures out that he said that she might be upset, but. Well, rest in peace to Pop, my one of my other grandpops, because my grand, one of my other grandpops, like my dad's father, he died in, like when I was like two, and then my mom's dad like, died when he, on Christmas Eve. Real sad. That's really sad. But um, I shouldn't worry because I don't know. I have a big family. I have a really big family, so yeah. 
So here, okay, let's move on with the Hesh checks again. So here is Hesh 2010. He looks pretty cool. It comes with like a trailer. That's where the jet goes. Okay, so let's take a look at the jet. The jet looks pretty cool. If you throw him, he doesn't fly. But um, you can just hold him around. Like for example, I'm just gonna um find like a spot where you can just you know, just holding a jet. I'm just gonna make move it to here. So then you can like watch. So like you can you can just play with the Hesh jet. So here's here's how you play with the Hesh jet. You can't just throw him because if you throw him, he will like fall down and break. Hold on. He'll fall down and break like this. He's not a flying toy. He's not a fl flying toy. I think you might I think you didn't see that, but um, if you didn't, I'll just try that again. If you didn't see that, I'll just try it again. So He's not a flying toy, see? See, he doesn't fly like any other plane. But the only thing you, that you can do is just keep him in your hand. But um, if you turn on the switch, he'll, he'll, it'll just make plane noises and not just turn on lights. Listen. Oops. Come on. Let's try to find him again. Whoosh. When, when you turn on the switch, hold on. okay, okay, we'll stop. So when you turn on the switch, it makes this noise. Now when you start moving, he turns on the lights. When you start moving him around with your hand, he'll, he'll start making flying noises like this. Okay, so here's another cool part about the Hesh 2010. So another cool part is that um, the one button is that it, it just activates the lights, but he's not working. But another part is when you press this button, it will lift up the jet. And then, and then it'll count down from 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, Two, one, whoosh. Like this. Whoosh. Yeah, the, the Jazz is a really cool toy. Yeah, he also has buttons like this. Like... Another one is just lights, and another one is just where he starts up. Yeah, so that, the Hester is the only one that makes noise. So, um, okay, next, we're going to move on to the next truck. What you bring in? Oops, wrong side. Okay, so I only have two more cars. First, I'm just going to show you this one, which is Hester 2011. He's kind of like a monster truck, as you can see, because of the wheels. He's pretty cool. And he comes with a race car. And he comes with a race car. Um, I got I got him the same day on, like, when I got to Hester 2010. I might have to show you the video when, when it's on my computer. But I, another Hester truck I got before I was at the Christmas party. So, yay. So, so he, so this, so this is where the high space car goes. It goes right here. So, um, he has four buttons. One was with the um lights, and the other three are, are like um sounds. So instead of here, yeah, that's the engine. Next one, that's the horn. This one's probably another. I don't know what it is. It's probably backing up. 
Yeah, when when you use the backup button, like the only the back lights happen, but not the front. Like that, and then the other ones are just the blinking lights. And there's only one sound that comes with the, this car, as you hear. Um, the switch. If you just turn on the switch, it, it turns on. It's pretty cool. Okay, so, and the best part is that there's a button up here. If you press it, it'll make a sound. Just one single sound. That's like a couple seconds. He's like racing. So there's that. And another cool part about this truck is that um, there's like a um, lift here, that, a ramp here where the car can go to the truck. So let me lower the ramp. It has the same sound as 2016. So, okay, so um, you can just push them onto the ramp and onto the truck. And then, it, it, then it will easily go back down. Okay, so that was the Hesh 2011, and I have one more truck with no with no um, exclusive vehicles, which is the Hesh Fire Truck from Hesh 2000. This was the this was the Hesh truck that I got before the Chris my the Christmas Eve party, and the other two the um the one Hesh RV I got on my birthday, and the other two um, Hesh 2010 and Hesh 2011. 11. Um, I got, um, after the Christmas party, and right before I read, um, The Twas the Night Before Christmas, I do that every year, so, um, maybe, and maybe during, like, near Christmas time, I'll show you some Christmas videos on, I, that I have on this computer. They're not, these videos that I have right here, um, all these videos, um, are with this camera. I, I really just do them a lot. So, um, and this one has three lights, has three, um, three sounds, no lights, no light buttons. So right down here, you can see that there's two switches. The red one is for the lights and the white one's for the sounds. So first we're going to just do the light. If we do that, all the lights will turn on. As you can see, the red light's on the top, one, one of the, um, uh, and there's two, a couple on the back. And then if we just... Onto the other one, it'll turn into like a fire truck, like, because the fire trucks like have like these kind of blinking lights like this. And then this one's blinking too. The back lights are blinking. This one's not. I don't know why. That's so that's kind of interesting. Okay, so now I'm gonna just show you the sounds now with the switch, because they go on forever. Because if you use the switch, you, they'll go on forever. Well, the, um, the um, buttons are a little bit more quicker. So first, we have this, the horn. And then we have is almost another, uh, first we have another siren. So here's the first one. So um, while, the, while the sirens are going off, um, the lights turn on like this. But, the, but with the horn, it doesn't. That's kind of weird. They could have kept it on. But if you want to have the lights on with the horn, you just go to the blinking lights on um, one with the switch, and then, and then there you go. Okay, so here's the uh, here's the other siren. Okay, so there is that. So, um, thank you guys for watching my video, um, Hess Review. If you like Hess Trucks, if you like Hess, Hess Trucks, please like the video and subscribe to my channel. I, um, I don't know what the, um, 2019 Hess Trucks could be, so, but I'll figure out about that soon. And, um, stay tuned for more videos coming really soon. And the Crafters Part 1 might come out this week. I'm sorry for the delay because um, I said